A sizable crowd had turned up at the Nyayo National Stadium for the third quarter-final match of this year's top eight tournament, pitting FC Leopards against Chemelin Sugar. It was FC Leopards' second appearance in the tournament. The first was in 2011, and last year they declined to play Gormaya in the quarter-final for fear of safety of their fans and players. And so the match went on without much incident, and it was all square at 2-2 until the 79th minute. Tony Opondo's third goal for Chemelil was the sucker punch for FC Leopards fans. Three minutes to the end of the match and with no equalizer in sight, a man casually walked onto the pitch and advanced towards the second assistant referee. He ignored pleas to stop from FC players and chose to chase the official across the pitch. <laughs> Soon after, others followed, and the mass invasion overwhelmed the few police officers on location. There were running battles all over the pitch with FC and Chamberlain players looking on, unable to intervene. The police intervened and tried to take away the man who started the melee, but they were overpowered. He was taken away by FC security officials. Police and fans then engaged in a stone and tear gas exchange. The power supply was cut and the stadium descended into darkness with players and match officials still on the pitch. <laughs> What you can see behind me is the aftermath of the FC Leopards versus Chemelil Top 8 clash that was abandoned with under 10 minutes to go after fan chaos erupted. When they came back on, no action resumed on the pitch. The most likely outcome after all this is that the match will be awarded to Chemelil Sugar. Maureen Mwende, Citizen Sports.